I'm just about to head out there again. Um, I'm going to Mount Nebo today to do the Man Arena track, which is really awesome. Lots of rainforesty areas um, on top of a really cool panoramic um, lookout over Sanford Valley. So I'll be taking you on that journey today. Um, just thought I'd point out, um, if you're running or doing any sort of endurance activity over an hour and a half, you're gonna need some fuel. Um, so you need to be eating something, basically, uh, because your body will just burn out. I mean, you do have stored fat on you, but I mean, we're not some survival mode here. We're just training, and if you wanna be able to train at your optimum level, you need to be putting some food in your mouth. Um, so what I do in my pack, I um, carry some dates and I sprinkle some pink Himalayan rock salt on them. Um, so you've got the best of both. You've got um, sugar, which is a good energy source. Dates are nutrient dense just on their own. Um, but I kick, up, kick it up a notch with the pink Himalayan rock salt um, because it does have like heaps of um, minerals and vitamins in it uh, along with your salt intake. So as you're sweating out, you're losing salt, sodium. That can lead to muscle cramping. Um, you don't want any of that. So salt, sugar, water. Hey guys, um, so I just arrived at Mount Nebo, um, just about to uh, put some anti-chafing stuff on where my pack rubs, um, so I just use paw paw ointment, um, there are a lot of specific sticks and stuff out there that you can get for chafing, but I mean not just use pop poly when it does the same thing. Um, so yeah, just you know, put it where your pack rubs. And you're all sweet. Hey guys, so I'm at the Morelia track um, at Mount Nebo. Uh, first person of the day, uh, lots of spider webs. Um, I'm watching my footing, seems a little bit snaky around. <laughs> just such a beautiful track. I'll uh, show you what I'm uh, running towards. So nice. So that's me done. Peace out. Catch you on the flip. <laughs> 